From the Irongo Mountain and surrounds Namibia, quite an appealing little guy. Uh, a predominant matrix on this one would be a, a, a quartz, so it's a section of quartz witch's fingers. So why I call them witch's fingers or known as witch's fingers would be a chubby, chubby base of the quartz crystal terminating in a thinner, into a thinner main termination. And dusting this would be a, a layer of highlight opal or opal AN. And then sitting on the crown of this car, we have a little shawl tourmaline crystal as well, which would be the black variety of tourmaline. Now, interesting facts about this uh, highlight opal, and you can actually see it here. Uh, have a look at that, that sort of glow running through, and that would be the daytime fluorescence. Now, under shortwave UV light, we'd have this bright yellow to green glow across the, the specimen, which would, of course, be the... Uh, the shortwave UV fluorescence, lovely, beautifully fluorescent, these guys. Can be displayed all the way around on the turntable. A little matrix section, a little bit of feldspar running through the solid quartz matrix as well. Looking from the top down, we have those quartz crystals. Then you have the little shell tourmaline crystal perched there as well. Ah, look at that fluorescence, and it's almost like a little worm going around the side. Little stalagmite stalactites of this highlight opal, which is totally gem, and in this case, sort of a yellowish-greenish color.